Pick, good day. Today's, uh, today's mission plan is to fly um, some spins. I'm um, fully endorsed for aerobatics and for spinning. However, that was about 12 months ago. Uh, and I've been doing lots of aerobatic practice, but I haven't spun the aircraft since I was in training. And uh, so I figure I need to go out and actually do a couple of baby spins, which is what my intention is. I'll probably do a couple of stalls first. And then uh, if I can get the courage up enough, I'll just do a couple of half and maybe one, one turn spins. Just to remind myself what it feels like, what the recovery is like. Um, I'll be using the pair recovery process. Um, and yeah, so I thought I'd put it in video so I could have a look later on to see if I did half a turn or one turn or what I, what happened. And uh, we'll see how we go. So we're going to be uh, doing it over the coast at Wollongong. There's a step at 4,500 feet. We're just waiting to, to clear. Then we'll climb up to about six, six and a half thousand 6,500 um, over water, which is where we'll uh, do my spinning. Um, so it was a pretty nice day. This cloud we're just going under now with the last of it. It looks like it's uh, full, uh, fully clear on the coast. Uh, I've got a nice day for it. SP indicator, we're doing 130 knots indicator now, 145 TAS. Um, so the, the end stop's 40 knots. The next one's 60, 80, 100, 120. So it'd be good to see when I'm spinning uh, where the airspeed sits. So here at, here at uh, 3 o'clock is 90 knots. So that'll give us an idea. 155 knots, 31 litres an hour. Not bad, is it? Gotta love an RV. So why I'm putting this way, I wish to do a couple of stalls. 60 knots. 58. Stall warning going off. Stick back. I didn't try and recover properly. There you go. That again. Bit of rudder. Bit of aileron. There it is. Another one. 80 knots. 60. Such a high attitude. Come on. Oh, I've got to go right this time. Bit of left rudder. There you go. All right, now I've got to, you know, face my fear and do a spin. So recovery would be power. Other on to neutral. Opposite rudder. Easy to load it forward and recover. If I can do it. Knots, stalling, back, rudder, over she goes, neutral, opposite rudder, elevator forward. That was pretty gentle. I was surprised how gentle that was. I was so scared of that. We'll come back to 6,000. I was quite overwhelmed with the recovery. I had to sort of you know, speak it. The same thing again. So, engine to idle. Let it stall. Rudder forward. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I actually enjoyed it. I think I went round once, I'm not sure. I'm pointing this way, that's where I started. Maybe I went round once, I don't know. That was fun. So, power, other on, opposite rudder, elevator, recover. So, nose up. And it comes back. So let it stall and hold the rudder and over it goes. That's one. <laughs> One's pretty full, isn't it? I'm trying to go one and a half this time. I guess we're high enough. Um, okay, I didn't lose too much height that time. It's really nervous about remembering how to recover. It's, it's quite overwhelming. So I think doing it, practicing it's a good thing because if I'm in aerobatics and I end up spinning, I think I should have some practice at recovering from a spin so I'm not so worried. 
and I actually enjoy it going over. Um, I don't enjoy it winding up. <laughs> anyway, let's try it again. 5,900, ball centred, idle. See, I forgot the rudder. That's all right. The, the RV recovers easily, doesn't it? It's, it's, as soon as I put the stick forward, it wants to recover. But I want to get the rudder fully opposite rudder before I put stick forward. I think I'm rushing it and just wanting to stop. Fifty knots, fifty-four knots. I said one, two, but who knows, that's probably just half turns. Back up to it again. 60 knots. 58. Right. One, two. Oh, there we go. So I think I put too much... Um, opposite aileron in that wanted to restall. So that was a different kind of spin. Of course I stalled it differently. I had a much flatter, I was much flatter when I saw the aircraft. I went, I really pulled back slowly rather than have a nose high one. Well, one and a half will do for now. I'm happy with that. I haven't done any any spinning since my training a year ago with this instructor sitting right here. It's my first solo spins. Um, I'm going to give myself a thumbs up. Uh, if you like what you saw, go and see Jeremy Miller at uh, Upset Recovery Training in uh, Archerfield in Queensland. And uh, I think it's a, a great skill to have all right, um, going to do a half Cuban, because I like doing half Cubans as I've been trying to practice getting them right. And, oh, the G's were 2.6, by the way, there you go. That would have been the pullout for sure, I reckon. But, so that spin was a 2.6 G manoeuvre, with a minimum of a 0.5. 145 knots, 142 knots, here we go, half Cuban. Looking, unload all the way, round you go, and stop. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, five and a half thousand feet, as I just do a loop. Here we go, ball centered. Five and a half, five thousand four hundred. Not bad. I'm getting better at these things. Might do a barrel roll to the right. One hundred and thirty knot barrel roll. Up. And we go. I'm loading across the top. That looks pretty good. Five thousand, five and a half thousand feet. One hundred twenty knots. What I went in. Look, look at that, it's pretty good isn't it? So I've got uh, 2230 RPM, a TAS of 140 knots and a fuel burn of 24 litres per hour. <laughs> There's not too many aircraft I think you can sit along at 140 knots doing 24 litres an hour. Um, we're running at 57% peak power, so it's, it's, it's trimmed up for peak. But look at, you know, my CHGs, the hottest one's 303 degrees. So <laughs> engine would run run at that forever at that temperature. Because we just love, got to love an RV6. Pretty easy fix, 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 fixed pitch prop, carburetor. 24 litres an hour, 140 knots still, hands off. So 
bit of that. I'm now tazzing 100 and up and down a bit. 155 knots at 28 litres an hour. Feeling like I'm slightly high, we'll do a bit of side slipping. Watch, I'll need power though now. I've got the stick, you know, neutral, and I'm not pulling it back too hard with I'm slide slipping. I'm sure I need power. <laughs> so 65 knots is by better approach speed. Hard here, it's always wobbly. Radios. Freeze. Can't be heat off. Looking at the horizon. Keep that nose well off the ground. Still off the ground. Still off the ground. Okay, nose also about to come down. Still off the ground, there it is. Lovely. Traffic weather burn, 11 mic kilo, clear all runways.